So we sold our house in Brisbane, Australia. And then I said goodbye to every single human that ever made an impact on my life in the last 33 years. And then I packed up with my ex-husband and my three kids to move to the land of God, Bali. Now this is my life. Good morning, good morning. Oh my gosh, this is my last day in Paris. And I thought last night was going to be my last live in Paris. But my intuition is like ever. Jump on now to explain this truth because I don't know who it's going to help right now in this moment. But I know that hopefully after watching this video, you're going to have a new vibration for this day, which is going to help you unlock this limitless wealth that we are desiring we are desiring and i just want to remind you that you're desiring it because you are it at your core you are limitless you are limitless and i'm just going to show you this for a second like look outside of this river i cannot tell you how many quantum particles are in that like next 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 level quantum particles and what we're doing with this work when we're desiring the abundance and we're doing the work and it's not coming in what we're really doing is we are removing all of the stories that were never yours to begin with that is all we are really 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 doing and we are awakening to a new level of being we are awakening to new levels of abundance, to new levels and ways of thinking and being and feeling because it just is you at your core. And I'm going to go deep with a few things today. So one, and, and stay with me. If it starts to feel uncomfortable, amazing. That means that you're doing the work. That means that you are actually sitting with what I'm talking to you about and things are going to start shifting for you. If you're stuck in your head and you're like, oh, I already know this, or I've heard this a million times, then just allow that story to soften and go, okay, cool. I'm receiving this today with a new level of consciousness, with a new level of being, with a new level of thinking, with a new way of receiving the information so that I can have the realization, the aha moment, the, the peace within me that I have been avoiding, which is the block for limitless wealth. So let's sit with that. So first and foremost, I invite you to completely and utterly delete the story that you're doing all the work and nothing's working because all the universe is hearing is nothing's working, nothing's working. And we don't want that story to go out. We don't want that story to be stuck in this world at all. We don't desire that story to be out there because it's just like, don't think of the pink elephant. Well, the pink elephant keeps coming. Now, what we have to understand about quantum particles is that Every single day, we are either rejecting or accepting them. By saying this is bad and this is good, well, saying this is bad, we're rejecting the quantum particles. We're like, oh, I don't want to deal with that. But the universe doesn't know what's good or bad. The universe doesn't know what a dollar is, what a million dollars is. It just knows what you're blocking and what you're calling in. And so we want to show the universe that we're calling in all of it. Limitless wealth, limitless abundance. And in order to call in all of it you have to know and do this one thing which is quite challenging it is complete and utter acceptance and love of every single thing that you have in your entire life right now you need to fall radically deeply unconditionally in love with your life because your life is you it is you manifested on the big screen and when we reject a part of our life and we're like, oh, I'm doing this, but it's not working. It's we're rejecting our, that part of ourselves. And so in order to unlock limitless wealth, it's accepting the whole. It's loving every single piece of you and living in this abundance frequency every single day. Now, there's so many pieces to this and there's so many different layers, which I do go through very, very deeply in the Limitless Wealth membership. But what I want you to understand and take away today is... How are you communicating with the quantum particles around you in a way that is serving you and unlocking limitless wealth? And this is everything right down to the way that you eat, 
when you go to a buffet, are you like eating 10,000 plates because you're like, oh my gosh, I'm never going to get this again. There's not enough. I've got to quickly eat more and more and more of this buffet instead of just taking the little bits that you desire because you know that there's so much more where that came from. You know that it's already done. You know that your wildest dreams have already manifested. You know that we live in a world where there is just literally like in insane amounts of limitlessness. And so you're in tune and in sync with it with so much love and joy and bliss because that's all that you are. That is all that you are and you know that the waves just keep coming. The waves keep rolling. The quantum particles never, ever, ever, ever stop. And so I truly invite you to go deep and just sit with yourself and go, okay, cool. Where am I rejecting life? Where am I not accepting the parts of me? Because where you're rejecting life is from lack, it's from fear, it's from not enoughness. And that vibration is why the overflow isn't able to come to you. But when we receive all of life, and I mean receive it, receive the deaths, this is where it gets deep, the death of a friend as a blessing. Receive, because, and you know, if you've heard me lately, you know I've been through a lot. And we have to understand that we all die in the end anyway. So when we go, oh no, somebody shouldn't die, we're rejecting life. Because the most beautiful thing about life is death. And on this journey, you will die a million times to get to the version of yourself that you truly desire. And you cannot be the version you are right now to attract limitless wealth. You cannot because the vibration that you're in right now is attracting the life that you currently live. And so in order to go to a new vibration, we have to go through the chrysalis. We have to go deep into the, the cocoon, which is what I do very, very well in the six weeks to quantum wealth, which is going to be coming up next year. If you want to get on the wait list for that, definitely let me know. But you have to shed those layers of yourself. You cannot expect to do everything that you're doing right now and have the exact same results because right now the vibration that you're in is in resonance to the life that you're currently living. And so that's why the universe keeps shaking me. It keeps rupturing me. It keeps like putting me into the chrysalis because I desire insane amounts of abundance, insane amounts of life and living and freedom and joy and bliss. And so the universe is like, have some more have some more, have some more, take some more pain, take some more grief, take some more of this. And I'm so ready for it. I'm so ready for it because I know how the universe works, because I know that I have to go into the chrysalis to come out of butterfly, because I know that the caterpillar doesn't grow wings without tension. It's impossible. It cannot. And so when you desire a limitless life, you have to be prepared to go deep into the shadows and look at what are you afraid of? Are you afraid of sitting with your bank accounts? Are you afraid of doing your accounting? Are you afraid of seeking help and guidance around your accounts and your business and things like that? And just really, 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 really sit with it. So I hope you got a lot out of this video. I went on a little bit of a ramp, a rampage there, but I think the truth in the nature around this and the most powerful piece to this is really going, okay, cool. Stop telling yourself bullshit stories like I'm doing the work. It doesn't, the story's irrelevant. It's irrelevant. It doesn't serve you at all. It doesn't serve you at all because the story is reinforcing a belief that you do not currently have what you desire. And the universe cannot match and mirror that belief without it giving you more of what you do not desire. And so in order to have the next level, you need to start reprogramming and going, everything is working out for me. All of my problems are solved before they even arise. There is no, do not even, do not even. And I've received some emails like, um, you know, regularly, which I love. But the truth is that if you take time to email someone and go, you know what, blah, 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 blah. Things aren't working for me. Things are challenging. You're reinforcing the story instead of rolling up your sleeves and going, okay, universe, what can I do right now that's going to change my life? Maybe instead of reaching out to Eva, I can join her Limitless Wealth membership because that's actually an action that invokes an energetic exchange that is going to change my life because I'm actually doing something uncomfortable. Because a lot of people, when they're in a low level frequency, they struggle to invest money. And so it is about doing the uncomfortable thing. My first ever business coach, it was like $12,000 for the year. 
it was so challenging. It was so confronting for me, but I had to become somebody that I wasn't already. And that version of myself was somebody that does invest in coaches because if you're desiring to charge for your product and service, but you're not willing to invest into someone else, you're going to struggle to get the results from it because you're out of integrity. You're out of a resonance to what you're desiring to pull in. It's like if you're desiring an incredible husband, you have to be the energetic match for that. You have to be the person that already has the incredible husband. If you desire the limitless wealth, you have to be the version of yourself that's already wealthy. So what does the version of yourself that's already wealthy do? They do not complain to anybody. They do not speak about their programs uh, problems because every time you speak about your problems, words cast spells. That's why they call it spelling. Yes, I do believe that there is a, a therapeutic process where you can vent and speak about things once or twice, get it off your chest, but stop. Stop after that because the more that you keep replaying the story, that's what the universe is listening to. The universe never stops listening to that story that you are repeating, that you are replaying. So instead of whinging to people, roll your sleeves up, do the work, go internally and just keep repeating, everything is working out for me. Everything is working out for me and go, what's the one thing I can do every single day? Well, visualize morning and night. Tell yourself that it's working. Tell yourself that you are limitless. Be in resonance with that frequency. Be embodied in that frequency. Feel the wealth and every time you fall into lack, come back to it. Come back to self. And when you fall into lack, love that too. Love it because it's part of the journey. And it's so beautiful and it's so delicious and there's nothing wrong with you. You are so freaking perfect. But do not... Do not, and I'm, I'm sharing this with you, not to have a go at you or be mad with you because I used to do this too. I used to do this too and it didn't serve me at all. I would whinge to every single person and be like, oh, you know, I'm trying so hard and it's not fucking working. And it's like, oh, delete, delete, delete. That shit does not serve you. Every time you repeat that, the universe is reconfiguring the quantum particles to give you a life that is not working. Don't ever say it again. Delete it from your vocabulary. Everything is working out for me no matter what. Life goes my way no matter what. Everything is moving so beautifully, so effortlessly no matter what. Life is a dream beyond a dream. I am living in overflow. Avalanches of abundance come at me every single day. I love my life so much. And it doesn't matter if you're looking outside and it's not a life that you truly love. But what you have to understand is that every single day you're tuning into a radio station. And yes, you can look at a reality that your body is trying to reject and you can learn how to accept it. And through acceptance and love of your current reality and your current situation, only then can you change the channel. It's almost like you're not even on the frequency if you can't accept your life. But the second that you love and accept your life, then you get to change and tune into new higher frequencies. Through love and acceptance, the next level comes. You cannot reject the video game and expect to go to higher levels of it. Rejecting any part of life is like sitting there with your arms folded going, I don't want to do it. I give up. And you are not that person. You are an old soul that came here to move mountains, to change this universe through its entirety. You are so freaking powerful. That's why this hurts so much. That's why this is so painful because you're just like, why am I not here? And you have to understand that your soul is so on board with your evolution, but you have to get your head on board. You came here to live a human experience. And often what I find with light workers, star seeds, old souls, is that your head is not programmed to have the light beyond your wildest dreams. Your soul is, your soul's ready for it. It's pulling you, it's calling you, but your head is stuck in trauma loops and patterns which are blocking the evolution of your abundance, of the money. And so you must start to become so self-aware that you are seeing the patterns, the loops, the cycles and going, oh, I'm not available for that. This is an incredible life. I'm so blessed. If you woke up today, I don't care if you're homeless, I don't care where you're sitting, whether you're in a mansion or you're sitting under a bridge or you feel like nothing's working for you. I'm here to remind you that it's all perfect. It's all so perfect and it's so beautiful and it's so delicious and you can have anything that you desire and more. So thank you so much for being here. I truly, truly hope that you enjoyed this rampage and yeah, just really lean in, lean in to this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful world that we live in, lean in and really just go, you know what, I'm just ready. I'm so ready for this evolution. I'm ready for the next chapter. I'm ready for the, the waves of abundance that just 
keep coming all the time. All the time. All the time. I love you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for doing the work. Don't take anything I say to heart. I've been through it all too. And sometimes I try to be more direct with you because I know that that is what you need to hear. You don't need to hear the like, it's going to be okay. It's all good. It's just fucking do the work. Roll up your sleeves and get real with yourself. Stop telling yourself bullshit stories and go, you know what? I'm actually not where I desire to be, but I love this and I accept this. And through the love and acceptance of this, I'm going to manifest what I desire because I know that I was made for more and I know that I came here for more than this. And that's what we do. That is the work. You've got this. You are so powerful. I'm sending you so much love and light. Uh, on the 10th of October, we are doing the Increasing Cash Flow Masterclass, which is going to be so beautiful, so powerful. I'm going to be tying in the spiritual energetics, the emotional, the mind, and just really allowing you to go very, 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 very deep in a 90-minute masterclass that's going to unlock and rupture you on the deepest, deepest, deepest levels. So thank you for being here. Big love. You've got this back yourself, believe in yourself. You have to be this motivational voice that just never stops backing yourself and believing in yourself no matter what. I know it's not easy. It wasn't easy for me too, but you can do this. I believe in you. I've got you and you are going to move and shake the world because that is what your soul signed up for you to do. Big love old soul. Mwah.